Hallo Sam. Once upon a time, three little pigs named Honky, Ponky and Minky lived happily with their mother in their home. One day, they came across a job posting in the park. The job entailed raking leaves in the park. Minky, the youngest and smartest brother, said excitedly, Mommy, we saw a job posting. Please, let us work half a day in the park tomorrow. While their mother considered their request, Honky and Ponky started dancing around her, making funny gestures. Begging her, Minky joined them too. Please, Mommy, Mommy please, let us, let us work! After giving it some thought, their mother agreed. Well, OK. The three brothers were so excited. They chose their clothes for the following day, took a bath and went to bed early. Early in the morning, they went to the park. The custodian let them know their shift would end in the evening. They got their brooms and started to work. Brothers, let's each take a corner and start raking, working our way in. Meanwhile, a pair of eyes watched the pigs from behind the bushes. It was none other than the wicked wolf. The wolf devised a plan to thwart the piglets from finishing their job. I'll teach you, little pigs. You will never be able to rake those leaves because I sent more your way after I blow them off the tree. Ha ha ha! You will see. The wicked wolf climbed the tree and started to blow the leaves. Honky kept raking the leaves but didn't see what the wicked wolf was doing. Too many leaves! The more we rake, the more they appear! Stop whining and rake away! We have little time left! The three brothers got back to work. Meanwhile, the wolf was going from tree to tree, shaking branches so the leaves would fall. He got to the tree next to Ponky. I'll blow all the leaves! Ponky could not understand why the pile of leaves wouldn't lessen. Then the wicked wolf jumped onto the tree next to Minky. I'll blow and make all the leaves fall on your head. The leaves fell like raindrops. Minky looked up and saw the wicked wolf blowing through the branches, making the leaves 
fall. He rubbed his eyes, thinking he had been under the sun for too long and was seeing things. But the wolf was still there, jumping from one branch to the next, making the leaves fall. Minky called his brothers immediately. Look up at the trees! The piglets were surprised. So they devised a plan right away. We are not afraid of... The Wicked Wolf! And they started to shake the tree where the wolf had climbed. The wolf managed to jump to the next tree. On the apple tree! This time they started to shake the apple tree. The wolf got dizzy from all the shaking, lost his footing and fell to the ground. I'm not done with you yet. We'll, we'll meet again. Yeah, right. <laughs> it's getting late. We have very little time left. The park is about to close and there are leaves everywhere. The three little pigs started to rake the leaves, even though they were worried. I've got a brilliant idea. This is how we do it. They rubbed the mastic tree sap. And put it on the rake tines. Thus, the leaves stuck. and they could gather more leaves in a short time. In half an hour, they gathered all the leaves in the park. They took a deep breath when they finished. On their way home, the three little pigs decided to buy a gift for their mother and surprise her. They wanted to buy a necklace, but even after putting their money together, it was not enough. If we can't afford a necklace, let's buy a nice cake from the bakery. They happily ate the cake and rubbed the frosting on each other's noses. Now tell me children, did you have fun working? It was fun mom, a little tiring but we still had a lot of fun. The leaves were so colourful and beautiful, they looked so nice as they fell to the ground. But it was funnier watching the wolf falling from the tree. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, subscribe to our channel Kondasan and watch the most popular fairy tales, cartoons, and nursery rhymes. Don't forget to click the bell for notifications.